عن عائشة رضي الله تعالى عنها قالت دخل عبد الله دخل عبد الرحمن بن أبي بكر الصديق رضي الله تعالى عنهما على النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم وأنا مسند وأنا مسندته إلى صدري وما عبد الرحمن سواك رطب يستن به فأب فأبده رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم بصره فأخذت السواك فقض فقضمته ونفضته فطيبته ثم دفعته إلي إلى النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم فاستن به فلما رأيت رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم استن استنانا أحسن منه فما رأيت رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم استن استنانا أحسن منه فما عدا أن فرغ رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم رفع يديه رفع يده أو إصبعه ثم قال في الرفيق الأعلى ثلاثا ثم قضى وكانت تقول ما تبين حاقنتي وذاقنتي وفي لفظ فرأيت ينظر إليه وعرفت أنه يحب السواك فقلت آخذه لك فأشار برأسي أن نعم هذا لفظ البخاري ولمسلم نحوه This hadith is narrated by Al-Imam Al-Bukhari And the wording is his The first narration is the wording is his And Bukhari narrated this hadith In Kitab Al-Jum'ah Kitab Al-Jana'is Kitab Fard Al-Khums Kitab Fadail Al-Sahaba Kitab Al-Maghazi Kitab Al-Nikah And Kitab Al-Riqaq Whereas Imam Muslim narrated this hadith In Al-Sahih Kitab Fadail Al-Sahaba Aisha radiallahu ta'ala and how we spoke about her biography previously and we mentioned um, her in the third hadith. We spoke about her in the third hadith. Her brother is Abdul Rahman ibn Abi Bakr who we haven't spoken about. He's the brother of Aisha radiallahu ta'ala and He took Islam Qubayl al-Fath He took Islam before the conquest of Mecca just before it wa hasul al-Islam and his Islam became very good wa mata fi Mecca and he died in Mecca sanata 58 he died in Mecca the 58 Hijriya Aisha radiyallahu ta'ala anha she said dakhala Abdul Rahman ibn Abi Bakr as-Siddiq Abdul Rahman ibn Abi Bakr al-Siddiq entered and when he entered on the Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam or the Messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam he entered onto us وَأَنَا مُسْنَدِيَتُهُ and I was the one I was the object that the Prophet was leaning on I was the thing he was leaning on alayhi wa sallam إِلَى صَدْرِ towards my chest the Prophet was leaning on my chest his head alayhi wa sallam وما عبد الرحمن أن عبد الرحمن ابن أبي بكر he had a سواك in his hand رط بود the سواك was رط رط meaning it wasn't dry it wasn't dry يستن به in which he was cleaning his mouth with فأبده the messenger صلى الله عليه وسلم ما معنى أبده أي مد نظره إليه وأطال the prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم he lengthened his look at him I mean, they looked for, at him for a long time, alayhi salatu wasalam. You see, looked at him for a long time. Aisha realized, because the other wording told her, فَرَأَيْتُ يَنْظُرُ إِلَيْهِ I saw him looking at it. In the first narration, it says, um, فَأَخَذْتُ siwak. I took the siwak from Abdul Rahman, her brother. Okay? In the other wording, she said, وَعَرَفْتُ أَنَّهُ يُحِبُّ siwak. I realized and I remembered that he loves the siwak. فَقُلْتُ I said to him, أَخُذُهَا لَكْ Shall I take the siwak for you? Whereas the wording of Bukhari doesn't say that. He just says that she took it. The wording of Mus the wording of, uh, no, sorry, the other wording of Bukh Muslim, the Bukhari, both of them are Bukhari wording, sorry. Bukhari, other wording, he says with his head this, this. He's very sick, he's his deathbed, alayhi salam. 
So he said, yes, get it for me. Get it for me. Aisha radiallahu ta'ala anhu, she said, Faqadimtuhu. Faqadimtuhu. Bama'ala faqadimtuhu. I chewed on it for him. I chewed on it for him. So she bit on it for him. And then what did she do? وَنَفَضْتُهُ um, And she took off what was on it, the things that were on it, meaning her brother's, the part he used. She took it off for him, meaning she break, broke it off. And I made it فَطَيَّبْتُهُ I made it ready for him, pure and nice and good. I mean, جَعَلْتُهُ طَيِّبًا صَالِحًا I made it ready for him. Then she said, ثُمَّ دَفَعْتُ I gave it to him. This is to show you that the wife should know her husband. She knew him, alayhi He didn't have to say anything to her. She recognized he's looking. You see? فَاسْتَنَّ بِهِ The Prophet, then he started to brush his teeth. Aisha said, فَمَا رَأَيْتُ I never saw. Rasulullah, the Messenger of Allah, إِسْتَنَّ استِنَانًا I never saw the Prophet purify and clean his mouth. The way he cleaned his mouth that day. فَمَا عَدَى He did not finish, alayhi salam. Meaning he... As soon as, as soon as he finished his brushing of his mouth, she said that he lifted his hand or his finger. Rafa'ayadahu, he lifted his hand up or his finger. And then he said, Fir Rafiq al A'la, a high level. I want the high level. Meaning three times. And then his soul was taken. And Aisha used to say, The Messenger Sallallahu died. مَاتَ بَيْنَ حَاقِنَتِي وَذَاقِنَتِي The messenger died on my haqina and my dhaqina meaning my chest here he was on her chest alayhi salam between her throat and her stomach so he was there alayhi salam he used to praise, he used to boast <coughs> the fiqh of the hadith one from the Sunnah is al istiyaku bi siwak al rat. The Sunnah is to use a siwak which is not dry. Two, jawaz al istiyaku bi siwak ghayra baad tanzifi wa tathiri. The permissibility of using a miswak that is not yours but somebody else's after you've cleaned it and purified it. Three. The permissibility جواز العمل بما يفهم من الإشارة والدلالة المفهمة. The permissibility on implementing something that was given to you by way of indication, not verbally said to you. Four. جواز the permissibility of دخول الأقارب. The permissibility of the relatives entering upon the wife. أقارب الزوجة على الزوج في حال مرضه وغيره. At the time when he is ill, the husband. Ha, the family of the girl can enter upon ha, the man who's married to their sister. Because remember the person who has to cover is the sister. And if these are from her side, then alhamdulillah, she doesn't have to cover. Ha. Five. جواز إسناد الزوج في حالة الصحة والمرض ولو في وقت النزع. The permissibility of leaning ha, uh, the husband or, or, on the wife huh? or leaning on something at the time when you're you're healthy or even when you're ill or even at the time when your nafs is about to be taken you can lean on something six shidda to hubbi rasul the excessive love of the messenger and he's striving for the siwak alayhi salatu wasalam mashru'iyatu the legislation of the tasawwuk fi kulli waqtin every time to do siwak because the Prophet ﷺ, he affirmed that for Abdul Rahman ibn Awf, Ahman ibn Abi Bakr. He affirmed it for him, like he was doing it every time that you could do miswak. You see? Number eight, قوة قلب النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم, the strength and the power of the Prophet's heart. Number nine, number nine. إثبات علو الله. To affirm that Allah is above and high up, up above his throne, alayhi salatu because the Prophet said, Rafiqul A'la, A'la, high. 
So he's going to his Lord. 10. Fadila to Aisha radiallahu ta'ala anha. The virtue of Aisha by her good way in which she lived with the Messenger. And the way she served him while he was alive. And even the last moments before he left this world. And that negates the batil concept that the Rafid, that the Shia al Mal'una belief of Aisha radiallahu ta'ala anha. Rafiq al A'la. Rafiq al A'la are the accompanies of the above. The accompanies of the above. Rafiq al A'la is the high stage, those you accompany. Rafiq means somebody who accompanies you. Who are those who accompany you in the high above? They are those who Allah has mentioned in the ayah in the Quran. In Surah An Nisa, ayah 69. Alladina an'am Allahu alayhim min al Nabiyyin wa Siddiqin wa Shuhadai wa Salihin. وَحَصُّنَ أُولَٰئِكَ رَفِيقًا Ayah 69, Surah An-Nisa. Naam. 